Why are we in Falcon? Uh, well, if you remember, no, I don't. we did a lot of side questing. Welcome to part 110 of Tales of the Abyss. Uh, we ended off, we ended off the side quest thing in Belkind, and now we're gonna go back to the actual plot. So we're going back to Yulia City. Can we go to the Winter Wonderland? Uh, you mean Ketterberg? <laughs> no, the other one. Uh, the one right in front of us. <laughs> um, actually, no, we can't. Uh, that is actually the Planet Storm. Oh. That's the. <laughs> That's the reason why we're coming to Yulia City in the first place. We need to figure out what to do about the planet storm. Honestly, I look at the I look at the planet storm. It looks more like a hurricane. It kind of does, except this time we can't use the upgraded flight stone to fly into it. It's 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 a plot wall, basically. <laughs> it's like wait, wait, we can fly through thunderstorms and stuff. Why can't we fly through the planet storm? It's like plot. They don't expect you to have it. <laughs> It's pl The short explanation is plot. The in-game explanation is memory particles. <laughs> it's but let's get down to it. It's plot. They yeah. don't. I, they don't it expect you plot. to have the flight stone. They're, they don't expect you to have the refined flight stone during this point. No, they don't. So we just have to come. Uh, we have to come back to the meeting hall here in Yulia City to discuss how we're supposed to deal with the new order that's now taken over the. All of Aldrin's. <laughs> and, uh, and look, looking much more like a general now. Uh, yes, we, that's another thing we got. We got his Viscount title. But he still runs, title. He still runs like a girl. <laughs> I'm keeping the Viscount title on for pretty much the rest of the game, because it's his best costume in the entire game, in my opinion. <laughs> I don't know, Doc. I don't know, Doctor Wombo do is pretty good. <laughs> well, Doctor Mambo title for Jade is pretty amazing too. I don't know. The I've been doing the Doctor Mambo for the entire game myself. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Luke does have one other outfit that I do really like, that, but I unfortunately can only get that on a second playthrough, and that's the Berserker costume title you get for talking to that guy back in the Colosseum. I'm gonna look it up here. And the jewel disperses yeah. them. If you go, if you get 200 battles or more and talk to that guy right outside the Colosseum, he gives you a title for Luke. All right, here's a here's some costume guides here. Do we even wow. know how to use the jewel? Wow. Yeah, there's a lot of costumes in this game. <laughs> no, not even that. It's just wow. <laughs> Yeah, I'll probably throw up a picture of it so you guys can see what it looks like. <laughs> he looks like a rejected grandma character. Well, at least to be fair, it looks better than the Abyssman costumes, right? <laughs> yeah, right. Abyss Red looks amazing. <laughs> I would love to show those off too, but again, second playthrough. It completely destroys the mood, but it looks amazing. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I mean, I'm I look at the Berserker costume, and it looks like he's a Ranma reject. A Ranma reject? Yeah, Ranma one half reject. I don't remember anyone from Ranma one half wearing an outfit like that, but Ranma, okay. <laughs> the female Ranma would would wear a uh, red fur right without the big collar. Okay. <laughs> Tyr and Mew found out, aka Mew found out and told Tyr about it. Squealer. Yeah, I feel bad for making her worry about. So yeah. And again, I'm pretty sure, like, it's weird, I honestly thought that Tyr would have found out sooner. I completely I forgot so. that she finds out because of... Mew. Yeah. <laughs> oh? Well, then perhaps you're so preoccupied with her that you haven't noticed. Doesn't Tyr get caught? And doesn't then this Tyr is the get... game doing forced shipping. Doesn't Tyr... For the last time. Doesn't, doesn't Tyr get a, um... Doesn't Tyr get an Abyss costume, too? Uh, yeah, they all do. <laughs> Uh, Tyr is Abyss Pink, actually. Apparently that's Anis, actually. Oh no, Anis is Abyss Pink, I'm sorry. Uh, Tyr is... Oh, uh, what color is she? I, don't... I can't remember. I'm looking it up. Yeah. I know Ash is orange. Or, uh, no, Ash is silver. <laughs> Guy is orange. <laughs> I think she's Abyss Black. That makes sense. Yeah, Jade is blue, Anis is, like is pink, and and Natalia blue. is green, I think. Blue. Blue. Light blue. Okay. A.K.A. the reject. <laughs> Actually, 
guys is the least popular one, which is why they gave him orange. <laughs> well, that's oh, well, that's fair. Sure, nobody liked the orange ranger anyway. And they even make they even make fun of that. <laughs> like why? <laughs> they even make fun of that in game because <laughs> because guys like why am I orange? Like, and that's it. He just kind of complains that he gets I think the orange that's what, costume. I think that's what the title says too. It's like what is it orange? Really? <laughs> it's also hilarious in hindsight when you know that Johnny Young Bosch is his voice actor and he was originally the Black Ranger. <laughs> uh, quick, tri quick trivia. Uh, but Yuri Lowenthal, I bet, or not, not, Larry, Yuri Lowenthal, let me, get, let me see me. Yuri from Tales of Vesperia actually gets a costume based on Ash. That makes sense. Not, not even, I think like, it's because he has costume, long hair so they could like, easily just recolor it red. Like, not even just the costume, even the hairstyle matches Ash. I mean, they do that. Um, I, uh, a lot of characters, um... Also, as part of, also as part of, uh, DLC. Yeah. They, they tend to do that in the, I think it's the later game, yeah, it's a, every game pretty much after Abyss starts doing that, like, when you get costumes that flat out reference original characters, they give it to the characters that look the most similar. It was really we it was really weird seeing, seeing Judith in Cosmo's costume. It did not, it like did not another fit example, I can hit. Another example is like Tales of Zillia. Um, you can get DLC costumes where Jude gets a costume that makes him look like Cress. Nah. And Mila can get a costume that makes her look like Dows. <laughs> Screw everything. <laughs> and the only reason Mila has a Dows costume is because she has the long hair that looks exactly like Dows's hair. <laughs> yeah, apparently, <laughs> apparently everybody got a um, a uh, Abyss costume in Vesperia as DLC. Yeah, some of them were Abyss costumes, some of them were references to Fantasia, some were actually references to, like, Symphonia. <laughs> That'd be amazing. <laughs> I know oh, in... I kidding? Yeah. I know the PS3 version of, of Vesperia, um, one of the new characters you get in that game, her costume Tears is Mythos. Cold, but she's actually pretty nice, huh? Everything's dead inside. What do you mean? <laughs> you really Anyways, seen her at all. Uh, <laughs> so <laughs> all we have to do now is just wander around and. Sure I have. As far as I know, you don't it's have to talk to me. everyone. You just have to go talk to Tyr. But what fun would that be? <laughs> yeah, what fun would that be trying to let, trying to talk to everybody? Oh wait. <laughs> <laughs> they have fun dialogue. <laughs> Dole. Also, I don't think it's voiced. Oh, and at this point, I think I was a little bit distracted, which is why you see the text stay up a little longer than usual. Are you stupid? Yes. <laughs> Only a child needs kindness to be blatantly <laughs> reminds me, obvious. Reminds me of that one, reminds me of that one skit from Fairly Odd Parents. It's like, it's like, um, it's like Vicky's evil. That was pretty obvious. How did you not know that? It's like, even the. Chip's dialogue made an, made an entire music video based on it. <laughs> what do you think that song? It's very it's like, true. What do you think that song was about? Pumpkins? Yes. If you haven't realized it for yourself yet, go and look for her now and see what you find. Oh, uh, cracks me up every time. Again, like, at least at, like if the game wasn't already throwing this in your face. This part would make a little more, would be a little less redundant, in my opinion. <laughs> Redundancy of redundant. Because I can't really fault Abyss for doing something that every Tales game does. <laughs> I can. Oh, who am I kidding? I mean, you, I can, but then I'd have to fault every game for doing it since the beginning of time. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Excuse me. When you learn that van. I mean, with no, that's fine. I mean, at least with like Fantasia, the trope wasn't established quite yet. <laughs> okay, it wasn't. Okay, <laughs> at least for that, because at that point, Tales wasn't a franchise yet. <laughs> By Symphonia, it became a trope. <laughs> because I think Symphonia is the fourth game in the series. Ah. I think so, yeah, because you got... Yeah, it's the fourth one. I you would know. Fantasia. And I decided I you had Fantasia, had Destiny, no Eternia, Even if it then Symphonia, then it's then Destiny 2. So. Going to the moon. 
Moon ride, moon ride, going to the moon. I had in this world. We're actually not going to the moon. Again, you're thinking of a, you're thinking of Symphonia. <laughs> Don't care. No going anyone, to the moon. Although technically, Tepeala wasn't the moon. Get up. <laughs> when I first confronted Van, turned my going on to it, the moon. I was like the a moon ride, animal. moon ride. That was amazing. Anything at all. Yeah. Come on, why would you not want you that? That would be amazing. I I don't <laughs> who, who wouldn't want a trip to the moon? I want to save this world. If I had the money for it, I would totally do it. Really Going to absolute. the moon. I can't stop singing that theme. You behind an absolute score. I can't blame you. Yeah, she didn't read anything As you can no doubt podcast. tell, this is going to be nothing but talking for most of this that's video. Why <laughs> that's why I'm singing randomly. On the hope that I know. <laughs> Although at least yes. this time it makes more sense because now everyone sort of has a reason for being hesitant about all this. Also, you're right. The uh, costumes were were exclusive to the PS3 version. Yeah, which is one of I think that's one of the that's one of the many reasons why people are pissed that we don't have the PS3 version of Vesperia. What just because of those costumes? Well, that's part of it. It's the fact that the PS3 version has a lot more stuff than the 360 version ever had. I have to say. I don't mean to say Flynn that looks extremely awkward as Luke. Doing, but... <laughs> oh, Flynn gets the Luke costume? Yes, Holy crap, he does. I didn't even realize that. And Estelle gets the tear costume, which also looks rational. looks very awkward because she, that doesn't fit her at all. No, I think it's because her dress is a little bit too big to have that costume. It's like a, it's like a walking stick. Hold on so hard to being rational. I mean, you're look. I mean, I'm looking at Tears outfit right now, and I'm just thinking, okay, if if Estelle's face is on that, no, she doesn't even. Doesn't Estelle feel doesn't even have the long hair; it's just short. I should leave Natalia to Tears. Uh, I think, and Rita, I think I gets a. Uh, I can't remember what costume Rita gets. Um, hmm. is it Natalia? I can't remember. I did, I I already clicked off of it. Hang on. Oh well, I'll find it. But don't worry about it nope, too much. I'll find it. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> I know you can get a Mew plushie to put on repeat. <laughs> oh, son of a... Uh, uh, I'll talk about that off screen. <laughs> They're not, this, these, these patch of screenshots aren't actually showing off uh, Rita's costume. Aw, oh, if she even gets one. Uh, I'm sure she does. Let me see here. Oh, well, you know, you're blue, you have weird ears, sound like a girl, and breathe fire. You're a thing. <laughs> Get used to it. Look up, here, I'll just, I'll just give you a dictionary. Here you go, Mew. <laughs> and he just falls to it. He gives him the dictionary, and he, he just falls to the floor with it. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> it's, like, it's like you're trying to lift up an anvil, and you don't expect it to be... It's like, no, I got a better, I got a better idea. It's like that one gif of, um... Deadpool asking Thor to give him his hammer, and as soon as he grabs it, it falls to the floor. <laughs> 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 Just think of that with Luke handing Mew a dictionary. <laughs> or Mew. <laughs> it's like the book just falls to the floor with Mew. Uh, I guess I'll have to... Um, well, have you done this part in your playthrough? Oh, I'm yet? past this part. Okay, so if you talk to them more than once, do they have extra dialogue? Um, unrelated dialogue, but yeah. Okay, they don't really they don't really say much afterwards. Okay, fair enough. After you talk to everyone, go back to the conference room, and now we can talk about dealing Just with Aldrin. <laughs> this jewel is inscribed with a or Aldrin, or however. By the way, it. <laughs> I want to mention since J since Jade and Mew are bes are beside each other, Please talking to either one of them activates that same that same uh, thing. Yeah, that makes sense. Its dispersive power and phonic art will activate, stopping the phonic glyph. So, okay. Sounds like a plan. We're going to use the key of Lorelei to get rid of the barrier out. around Aldrin. How do we do that? <laughs> Throw it at it. Yes. <laughs> Throw it. <laughs> Throw the sword at it. <laughs> I'm sorry. Key. <laughs> Throw the piece of shit. <laughs> I mean, we only have part of it, so... <laughs> Every time you say "Key of Lorelei," I just keep thinking of that one, that one, that, that one scene from uh, Red vs. Blue. 
key. I keep thinking of the Keyblade, because I'm just like, you know, Sora has a Keyblade. <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry, I, I just keep thinking of it. It's like this. It also, we found out the Tucker Let's Sword is really a big key. Right. Yeah, it's a key that can still stab people. What about you, <laughs> but you it's okay? a key all the time, and when you I'm stick fine. it in someone, it unlocks their death. Hey, what about me? <laughs> <laughs> Sounds about right. Like, church replies. <laughs> God damn it, I just love to live in your world for about 10 seconds. Is ready? <laughs> oh, I, I love this part. <laughs> Jade, no. Then we're off to the absorption Wait, Jade. One of those responses sounded weird. <laughs> oh, details, details. Details, there's no time. There's no time. Let's go. Move. Ow. <laughs> <laughs> God damn it, Jade. Planet Storm, the final frontier. Huzzah! We're finally going to the final dungeon! The eyes. Eventually! But first we have to kill Largo. <laughs> well, that's part of the final dungeon, actually. That's the absorption gate, though. True. <laughs> <laughs> that doesn't really count. Okay, fine, we're going to the semi-final dungeon. <laughs> Quote-unquote. No, it's not even quote-unquote. The, the absorption gate is the second-to-last dungeon of the that game. Was not. As far as I remember, it is. Aren't you forgetting a place? <laughs> a place we haven't been to yet? Oh, yeah, you're right. <laughs> a place we a place we briefly mentioned, and, but never actually went to yet? Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. We, have, we have the other gate that we were in for about two seconds that we didn't do anything we didn't with. Do, we didn't even go in there. It just cut to Ash in there and just walked away. Well, that's what I said. We 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 referenced it, and Ash was in there. but <laughs> Ash was in there, played patty cake, and then left. Well, to be fair, one of us had to go. One of one of us had, one of us had to be at the absorption gate. The other one had to be at the radiation gate for it to work. So, what if we just went there and doodled? <laughs> <laughs> like not even just. What if what if Ash just sat there and doodled in there? And he's like, oh, this is all, this is all Luke's fault. Go fix it. <laughs> I got like, okay, replica, you get to go through the radiation gate now. There's monsters in there now. Why? I let them loose. <laughs> <laughs> There's monsters in there now. Why are there monsters in there? I don't know. <laughs> as soon as I left, they started showing up. <laughs> oh, wait, I forgot to lock the door. Have fun, though. God, <laughs> son of a bitch! <laughs> well, not my problem now. <laughs> you dumbass! <laughs> like, well, it is your problem if we can't get to Aldrin. I can go in there and fix it. <laughs> with your with your pitiful stats? <laughs> no, that'd be... No, that'd be Ash. Like, Fine, then, Replica. Go in there and fix it for me. <laughs> <laughs> Never that. Is that, and while you're doing that, I'm gonna go to Eldrin. With your pit, with your weak ass dads, shut up. <laughs> Fuck you, that's why. <laughs> no, like they're climbing up the stairs, and and you see Ash flying up, getting flipping the bird to everyone. <laughs> like you do know the God Generals are up there he's too, right? Yeah, he's like, you, you still flipping the bird. He's still them. flipping the bird. <laughs> no, he did, He doesn't even respond. He just he just he just looks at everyone flipping the bird. <laughs> he doesn't even respond. <laughs> Makes sense. Now they gotta figure out what's gonna happen when we destroy the score entirely. Destroy the planet storm. And destroy the planet score. The planet. <laughs> the planet storm. score. Because the planet storm. <laughs> planet score. Get your get your future red by causing a thunderstorm. <laughs> <laughs> well, the planet storm is apparently stabilizing the planet right now. <laughs> mainly because we threw a mainly because we threw a battleship at it. Well, I mean, it makes kind of, it kind of, it does make sense. It's, it's the same kind of logic that they were having about, like, okay, what happens when we unite the worlds in, a, in Symphonia? I mean, they've been divided for so long. Two years, and two years later, that well, what adverse effects might happen if they reconnect? That <laughs> <laughs> reverse effects my ass. I'm not using it to bring up that yeah, game, don't worry. I'm just saying it's the same kind of logic they're thinking of. <laughs> yeah, but that, that game went nowhere with it, so let's not even bring it up. And I'm not even and I'm not even joking. It went absolutely nowhere. Anyway. Yeah, anyway. Ah! Here's the absorption gate. Oh god, my eyes. <laughs> You'll be happy to know it looks. It doesn't look anywhere near as bright as the 3DS version. <laughs> <laughs> Thank God. It's not. In fact, it's not even that bright. It's just like one. It's just like. Uh, it's like one of those. Uh, it's one of those giffy tubes. It wasn't super. I think most of the brightness came from the fact that the screen was transitioning still. <laughs> 
That's the only kind of brightness you'll ever get in the 3DS version. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Back to the Fortress of Solitude. Hopefully the Justice League isn't in here, otherwise we're screwed. Nah, no, Fortress of Solitude is Superman's home. Justice League has Justice League. Yeah, has but a, I thought the Justice League hung out there all the no, time. No, they don't hang out. They don't. They don't hang out Superman's like home. The they hang out. Spa I thought that was their meeting place. No, the Watchtower is their meeting place. That's <laughs> in space. There the, no, I'm thinking of the Hall of Justice. My bad. <laughs> Wait, that's it. I did not even know you could go up there. Is there any point to go up there? I know. I thought you could. That's why I'm out. It doesn't hurt to always double check because this game likes to hide chests in random spots that you wouldn't think Why is Jade not in your party? Um... Why are you putting in... I think it's because I was leveling up. No, no, no. Up. The bigger question is, why is Italia in your party? <laughs> You'll see why. <laughs> I know why. I don't know why she's even in there. You'll see why. <laughs> With her pitiful stats, she ain't gonna do jack. <laughs> It's like so far. It's like you so know, far. It's like so far off. Fire off an arrow and be like, ding. <laughs> just bounce off. They hit guy in the eye. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> then it's the crazy anyway, story all over since again. We've already gone through the absorption gate before. All we got to do is warp down. No, she like shoots an arrow at it. <laughs> it comes off, bounces off Vargo, hits guy in the eye. <laughs> <laughs> it's the Christmas. Poor it's guy. like the Christmas story all over again. <laughs> no! Ho ho ho! God damn it. Merry Christmas, everybody. <laughs> so, below the passage ring, so we gotta run all the way back down there again. Hey, look, treasure. Go over there and pick that up. If you haven't gotten your Mitchell stuff. Boots. If you haven't gotten this stuff yet, well, you can get it now, then sell it for stuff. There's certain things that are a little bit difficult to figure out to get because you have to go out of your way to get like random warps. Yeah, I got I met I got them before actually leaving this place the first time. They're not really that big a deal if you miss them. There might be one capacity core in here that I missed, yes, but it's not that is. big of a deal if you miss it. There is, and there's also a carmine chamber as well. I think I got the carmine chamber, but I might have missed the capacity no, core. You didn't get it because um you would put you would have went there, but we saw you go there by now. Yeah. Oh well. At this point, I don't need him. <laughs> I need every single capacity car I can get. No, wait, wait, wait. I'm sorry. That's a that's a cha that's a phone slot chamber. Yeah. I need every phone slot chamber I can get. Just problem is, like, like I said before, there is one downside I have to this game, and it's the fact that you they reuse dungeons a lot. <laughs> Why isn't everything dying? Oh, who am I kidding? They're they're kind. Of, they're dying faster than the last time I was here. That's why I said, "Oh, who am I kidding?" I mean, if you're strong enough to take these guys out super fast, that's great and all. But I'm not super over leveled at this point. <laughs> I wouldn't even bother. You might be by the time you get here. I wouldn't but... <laughs> even bother using Swallow Fury. Eh, I was just trying to get through it as quickly as possible. It only takes 25 seconds or so. <laughs> Too good to waste. Deal. Oh yeah, this is one, this is a skit you get if you go into a battle with the Viscount costume equipped. It's a, change, it's a pain to change anyway. <laughs> and now, it, now Natalia and Anister are gonna be like, "Why are you wearing those fancy clothes while fighting?" I'm like, why not? <laughs> It's like, well, well, wait, if they get damaged, I won't have to wear them anymore. This is my permanent costume. <laughs> <laughs> if they get damaged, I can't sell them to get money back. <laughs> no, that, that looks strange of thought is, wait, if I wear these, they means they get destroyed. And that means I won't have to wear them anymore. <laughs> Huzzah! <laughs> anyway, I'm going to be right back. I need to use the washroom. I'll be back in, like, a minute. Oh, dear. I'm all by myself. Uh... Pancakes, syrup, um, eggs, something, something to distract him. Distract, uh, something to distract him. Also, Tales of Pisaria is a, is a prequel to Hysteria. Why? Curse you, Namco. Why do you keep doing this? Ah. Ah. Stop doing this to us. Seriously. We don't need prequels to everything. 
You tried to do this with him. You tried to do this with Don, and then when nobody liked it, you you said it was non canon Stop doing that. It's not doing that. Also, here's Judgment. It does absolutely jack. It does the exact same thing. It does in What is the point to it? <laughs> so, Judgment is a complete waste of time. Good to know. Thanks, Past Tire. Also, you're going backwards. Um, panties. I'm back. Oh, good, you're back. <laughs> Told you I wasn't gonna be gone. I left a rant. You're welcome. No, I think what I'm doing here is just making sure that, because, like you said, you can't actually get the chests that you forgot. Yeah. So I think I'm just wandering around making sure I didn't miss anything. <laughs> you're. I left the mini rant while you were gone. I could kind of hear it while I was away, <laughs> like. They're like, Pass Sire, why are you going backwards? I'm going backwards to make sure I didn't forget That's anything. That's not what I was ranting about, but okay. <laughs> oh. Like I said, I only heard that part of it. <laughs> I'll hear about it when I'm putting the part together. <laughs> anyway, all the enemies are the same, too, so... <laughs> Way to go, guy. Way to go, guy. <laughs> hey, he tried. You don't ever use Demon Fang on floating enemies. Just saying. Yeah, at least it hurt him. <laughs> it hurt him. <laughs> <laughs> now I'm actually going to make sure he uses the damn Mystic Art. And there, there we you go. go. <laughs> they only have one guy. Oh, no, wait. Oh, you got, Never mind. You got the yeah, other guy, too. The other guy was off screen. He just didn't die. No, the, other, <laughs> the other guy was off screen. That's what happened. Yeah. Difference is so obvious. <laughs> I am so... St I'm more style than you, Luke. Shut up. Hey, who's the Viscount now? <laughs> and who's the guy? And who's the guy that almost got laid? Shut <laughs> up. <laughs> Wait, when did he almost get laid? <laughs> <laughs> no, well, actually, now that I think about it, it's like, who's the guy that's wearing? Who's the guy that's looking better than you? It's like, who's the guy that's Viscount? Who's the guy that actually has respect? <laughs> <Fuck you. laughs> And then there's that treasure chest over there, too, that I keep forgetting how to get. <laughs> and there's this asshole! <laughs> that might be the treasure chest I'm thinking of that has the capacity core in it. Uh, no. Or, like, a... That or a carmine chamber. Something. Something minuscule that I'm not really worried about missing That's out on. That's not a carmine chamber. Ah. <laughs> uh, do you know what it is? Hmm... I think if my memory serves me right, I think it was an herb or something. Oh, one of those stat increasing I believe so, items. Yeah. Okay, so it's not that big of a waste that I missed it. Anyway, coming up here, uh, we are going to be fighting one of the god generals down here. Which, which, as you can tell, I thought we'd be going to the bottom. I thought we were video. going to the bottom floor. Well, we are, yeah, but see, not that quite there yet. But now that we've already solved this puzzle, all you got to do is run all the way over here. <laughs> You think they put a sh you think they put a quick jump, but nope. Well, I mean, it's not like it takes that long to walk over there. You think they put a quick jump here, but nope. Yeah, you think they put a quick jump at a lot of places. Also, this is a save point. Yeah, I would laugh if Patch you tried to solve the puzzle again. <laughs> Why would I try to solve the puzzle again? <laughs> it's like you. It's like, oh no, I forgot to do the puzzle. Wait. <laughs> Wait. Then how did I beat it the first time? Wouldn't they be called New Oracle Knights? Legretta, Largo, or Sink? Well, at this point, they've already gotten used to them being here. <laughs> By the way, what made us come here again? Well, possibly all of them. Uh, we're stopping the planet storm. Yeah, but who did? But um, what makes? I just just and, the, what makes it? I'm just I'm just wondering what make. I was like. Talia. Didn't they say? Okay? Didn't Largo say that he'd specifically be down here? You look pale. Don't push yourself. I don't remember if he said specifically here, but he's he did say the next time we meet, I'm gonna try and kill you this time. <laughs> hey, by the way, this scythe, I'm actually gonna use it now. <laughs> instead of just trying to he does use like, it. instead of trying to body slam you, I'm actually gonna use my scythe now. <laughs> Anyways, uh, we're gonna go fight the next god general in part 111. It's totally not Largo. Shifty eyes. Okay, it, it, okay, fine. 
No point in suspending it. We're no point in keeping you guys in suspense. We're gonna go fight Largo. <laughs> because why not? 